Yes, Abdullah. Yes, child. How are you, Abdullah? So what do you want to say to us? Yes, child. I want to say to you one thing. What one? What, you don't want to talk about the topic? Child molester like your prophet? What are you are saying, child? I have not followed your uh, topic. I have just come. Just come to for what? For in, in your uh, YouTube. Yeah, and what do you want? I want to ask you one thing. Mm. Don't ask me the size of my shoes. What what is the reason? Uh huh. What is the reason? Uh huh. Of all this misery. Uh huh. That Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam did. Uh -huh. what, for what reason? For what reason? Give me. What was this reason? Oh, to get uh, to get women, to rape women, to get money, vagina, sex, power. So what reason? What misery? Muhammad, you have a misery? He have 13 wives for what? Is that a misery? Somebody have a misery. He have 13 houses and he have tons of slaves and servants to, ser to, to serve him. And that is supposed to be misery for you. How many wives do you have? What, was it a law before, before he was a prophet that you cannot have more than 13 wives? This is not the question. A person he have a no, suffering no, no, no. from a, a person, a person who is suffering from misery, how he can afford to have thirteen houses and thirteen wives and hundreds of slaves? Child, answer my answer. answer, answer. The, the child is your prophet, the one who do not know how to pronounce his name. He spent his life having sex, but he did not have time to learn how to read, how to write. Now answer me. How somebody is suffering from misery? What misery is? that to have the fifth from every attack what misery it is to make verses saying that anyone go to the booty the first and the biggest and the best booty go to the prophet is that a misery blah 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 blah, blah. listen mm. listen child you know how many battles he fight how many what you know how many battles battles you know your fight. prophet never fought anyone he used to hide in the end at the end Show me, sure? show me the reference where Muhammad he attacked and he was holding a sword and he killed somebody. He was a coward. The only time Muhammad he ever fight when they broke his teeth and here he, he was he was hiding in the back. Is that true? You said you said now he have never fight. And yes, he, he never fight. They throw a rock far, from far away at him and they broke his teeth. He was always hiding in the back. And where did did this happen? You don't know. I ask you, you are the teacher. You sure, you're sure. Well, let, let's see when this happened. You see my screen? <clears throat> yes, child, I see your screen. One more time, you say, child, I'm going to, to send you back your mommy. Here we go. Uh, Here we go. Look, this look, is the hate in the front of your child molester, look, like your prophet. Why, this is you, this is this is your this is your child. prophet. This is your prophet. They broke they broke they broke his teeth. Do you see it? And this is from the beginning of Islam. After that, Muhammad never had any fight with anyone. We don't lie. We don't make things. We don't make things up. What is your proof that he have never fight anyone? Show me. That? Show me how he fight. Where? Go ahead. I don't have the screen. Then shut up. No, no, you want screen. Show me the reference. I don't care. You know, having a screen or not does not change anything. Yes, I know. Show me the reference. Your prophet is a coward. Here we go. He lost his teeth. He lost his I teeth. He, he you see, the Muslims here, they are saying that, you know, like the translation is not really good. It says, Kusirat Ruba'iyatu Rasulullah. All his front teeth is gone. All of them. How this guy even can recite Quran after that? So if Muhammad want to say, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim, he say, Bismillah Try to take your teeth off and let us see how what, you can, what you can say. A prophet of God who recite Quran, he have no teeth no more. How he can recite Quran? Where did it say he have no teeth? It says in the front of you. It says, the mo the um, uh, a molar of the messenger of Allah was broken, and he was wounded, and the blood started pouring down from his face. What is molar? In Arabic, I don't know what is in English actually. For me, rubaiyatahu, the, the, all the teeth of the Muhammad in the front, uh, up and down, they are gone. Amolar. I don't care what English is saying. For me, I read it in Arabic. Here we go. Do you speak Arabic or you are not? In Arabic no, speaking. I'm, I'm so you pray to Allah in Arabic, but you do not know Arabic. It says in the front of you, Kusirat Rubaiyatu Rasulullah. Do you see it? 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So now, where is your God, Allah, to protect Muhammad, who is going to recite Quran? How he can recite Quran and have no teeth? Why didn't he die if he was not protected? Will he die? Who told you he did not die? In this fight, in this battle. Not this fight. Later, he was he was killed like uh, a rat. A, a woman, she called him by poison. Did he die by poison like a rat? Did he die like a? Did he die? Did he die by poison like a rat? Yes or no? Did you know you? I'm asking you. Did he die by poison like a rat? Yes or no? No. Here we go. Shut up. And this is and this is the hadith. This is Sahih Bukhari. Here we go. Answer. Read it. You know. Don't tell me no. It's in the front of you. It's in the front of you. Shut up and get lost. Don't call me again, you kid. Child molester like your prophet. I am the child. Donkey. I just allow you to speak so I can spank you. That's all. The prophet in his element in which he died, he used to say, Oh, Aisha, I still feel the pain caused by the food I ate at Khaybar. And at this time, I feel if my order is being cut off from this poison. How dare you even to speak to me? Do you know you are talking to who? You have a screen, you don't have a screen, I don't care. A prophet who have no teeth? Yet he will recite the Quran correctly. <coughs> yes, Abdul. Hello? Yes, Abdul, go ahead. We are live on air. Are you live right now? Yes, how I can help you. <clears throat> okay. So, so you are a Christian prince, huh? Yes, I am. And you? Okay. You are the slave of Allah? I'm the slave of Allah. Jalla Jalalu. And why Allah he need the slaves? Huh? Why Allah he need the slaves? He created slaves. He's he, the he, one. He created slaves. Okay, so, so he is a slave, but, uh, a slave vendor. So, Creates, you can never question him. Okay. Get it? Oh, okay. Well, I can. You cannot. I can. You can never. Okay. If you are questioning, you are shaitan. You are a devil. Well, this is according to you. You know, for me, I believe that your God is shaitan. Listen, you know, I'll just tell you something. Uh, so, uh, what kind of you, God? What kind of God? Muslim? What kind of no, God? You, what kind? Muslim, my friend, what, what kind of Christian? what kind of God? He say, in the case of murder. Free white man for the free white man, slave for the slave, and women for the women. Is that God or this is a crazy person? Listen to me first. Are you Christian or, or were you Muslim before? I am a Christian. I'm not a Muslim. I've never been stupid all my life. So you've never been Muslim? Okay. I've never been stupid all my life. I told you. What, what made you put this interest to become, uh, uh, to like become, learn about Islam? Well, I like I like to save Muslims. This is my interest, my friend. You like to save Muslims? Yes, from going to hell. I don't want to see any Muslim going to hell. So how are Muslims going to hell? How do you because know? Because they believe they believe in Shaitan. They think he is his God. They call him Allah. So first, describe Shaitan. What is Shaitan? Shaitan is somebody promised me sex, vagina, penises, long penises, strong sex. He deceived me by 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 sexuality and money. He promised me I will be rich, so he can deceive me. This is what Shaitan do. Shaitan he use all the material in this earth to deceive us. To not to follow God, and this is what your what your Allah do. He promised you endless penis. He promised you that you will have the power of forty men. He promised you that you will have a vagina and you will have a penis so which is going to fit for it. All these claims that you're making, right? All uh, these claims. That I'm not. I'm not. I'm not making claims. I can show it to you. Do you want to challenge me? No, you said because you, you are saying penises. You're. you're yes, you're, I'm you're saying. I, yes, I, yes, I'm. I'm saying penises. I'm not. I'm not lying. In order, in order for you to have a debate, right? Mm. Listen. Mm. So in order for you to have a debate first, you have to like fix your language. You know the, the, the way that you speak. Okay. It's not like okay. What what Christians word what word I said what what word I said what word I said your God did not mention. Hold on. What word I said your God did not mention. Are you saying to me your God Allah is not polite? Okay. So did Allah mention the word vagina? Did Allah did, did Allah mention the word vagina? Yes or no? Anything. Did Allah mention the word vagina and? Did, did Allah mention the word vagina in the Quran? Yes or no? What are you saying? Did Allah mention the word vagina in the Quran? Yes or no? Never, never. Chapter 24, verse number 31. It says, read with me. Okay. Read. Chapter 24. Oh, wait, just wait. Verse number 31. Okay, okay. chapter. Mm. Just wait a minute. <coughs> 
So I have a question for you. Just uh, no problem. Let's, let's finish one. We we we'll finished. I I said the word penis. I will show you the word penis. I said the word vagina. I will show you the word uh, vagina. I said yes. to you what whatever I said to you, I will prove it to you. I don't say things from my own. So you are using Allah now to be not polite and not to be a person of respect. Shame on you. You are insulting your God because you just said the one who mentioned the word vagina is not respectable. You, you are the one who is insulting the God of. You see, no, no, no. You said to me, you said to me, fix your language. Everybody heard you. You said to me, fix your language. And I said to you, which word I use in my language? It's not good for you. You said to me, you say vagina, you say penis. I will show you vagina. I will show you penis. And now you just insulted your God and your prophet. So which chapter are you talking about? Chapter 24, verse number 31. There's many, many, many chapters. I'm just, I'm just, I'm showing you one of them. Verse number one. Thirty-one, chapter twenty-four, verse number thirty-one. Thirty-one. Okay. Thirty-one. Just wait. <coughs> okay. Allahu Billahi min al-Shaytan al Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. Okay. Hmm. You said, and say to, to say to the believing woman that they should lower their gaze and guard their modesty. What is the word? What is the word modesty? You speak Arabic, don't lie. Okay, listen first. Do we no, no, no. Why you lie? What modesty? Does it say vagina or no? Does it say vagina? Does it say vagina? Does it say vagina? Yes or no? It says for it says for I speak Arabic better than you. It says for Listen, you are talking about first. Uh, I have this one question for me. Have you ever seen a person that you know? That he knows, like you know, he 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 knows about math only, and he's teaching you English. My friend, why you are changing topic? I don't. I don't uh, your your prophet do not know math. He do not know English. He don't even know Arabic. Yeah, Does, that, is the right. word he, is he, the he, word forage? Is the word forage here? Verse number twenty four. The verse before it twenty four thirty. It says, "Wajhfadu furujahum." Furujahum. What furujahum is? Explain to me. So furujahum. It doesn't say vagina. It says it says it in a way that it's. <laughs> It's making it's making a parda, you know. It's making a hijab. You get it? Really? <laughs> hey, hold on, 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 hold on. Okay. Let, let, all right. Let, let me let me let me ask you. Who is the one who teach you Arabic? So, so if a woman if she women she wear hijab, still this is this is how she how she guard her vagina. So if she have sex with the with the neighbor behind the hijab, it's okay. Listen, you you got you got you, you're making claims that doesn't make any sense at all. You know, ah. you're just trying to make claims or claim you're trying to deceive. Okay, people more, uh, more. okay. What about okay? Well, let us go. Let us go with this. Did your prophet say that your penis will be strong? <laughs> Yo, know, first. First, you gotta fix your own beliefs. Your beliefs. You see, you're 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 you're, you're scared. You're scared. Here we go. This is the hate in the front of me. This is your this is your this is your prophet saying. This is your prophet saying that you will have a penis. You will have a, you will have a penis. Will never go sleep. Does it say that or not? Does it say that or not? Why your prophet he says that? You have a penis. Will never go sleep. Sunan so Sunan so Ibn Majah, Hadith number four three three seven. Yes or no? You, you 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 are changing topic, right? What about Abu? What 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 about what about what about Abu? What about Omar? What about Omar? Hold on. What about Omar? Did your prophet? Did your prophet say? Shut up. Did your prophet say the one who is proud about his inheritance? He said, go and say to him, bite. Shut up. You talk too much, coward! You don't let me talk because you're afraid. You, you, are, you will not let me talk because you are afraid. You are afraid. You are afraid. For your arms, never. Why you don't want to talk? You gotta be really careful. That see, guys, he opened a topic. You don't want to talk about it. You are just going with translations. You know that there's a person. He's he's. No, you translate for me. Here we go. This is the Arabic. You translate for me. Shut up. This is the Arabic. You translate for me. The translation is your translation, and the Arabic is in the front of you. Abdul, Ab Abdul, you be you you believe in the devil? Scream, scream! This is what the devil do when he hear the truth. The devil inside you is screaming. Why you will not let me talk? How we can have a conversation? You're creating more fitness. You're not doing any good to the people. See, guys. You're creating more. Keep going, keep going. We are laughing. 
more enemies. You're creating more enemies for your own self. You're creating. Don't worry. Enemies, okay? Make a threat to me. No problem. Make a threat. Make a threat to me. What you want to do? You want to kill me? You want to kill? Are you are you threatening me to kill me? Are you going to kill me? Are you going to kill me? You are half half coward. This is your prophet talking, and not only that. Look what your companion and your, your prophet he said, the one who is proud about his inheritance, say to him, I do who be him a bee. Go and tell him, bite the penis of your father. Coward. A recording machine. He will not let me talk because he's created to hear the truth. Fix your language. What kind of a prophet he said to a person, the one to his followers, the one who is proud about in heritage before Islam, say to him, go and bite the penis of your father. What about I show you? He says, go and suck the clitoris of your mother. Is that better? And you are talking about fixing your language. What about Omar? He says, go and suck the clitoris of Allah. I will call you back just for fun so we can laugh. So are you going to listen or you will scream like a devil? Are you going to talk to me one for one or you will speak non-stop like a woman in the delivery room? Khabis. What's up? Khabis. Khabis is your prophet. Are you going to talk to me or you are going to just uh, go crazy? Like because the devil inside you can, cannot stop. Hmm. Okay, let me ask you then. Let me ask you. I don't you you mentioned this. How come you're a prophet? How come you're a prophet? Okay, hold on, hold on. He will, he, will, he will not let me talk. He will not let me talk. <laughs> Abdul, okay, as long if you recite this verse, Shaitan will run away. And uh, this is about black magic. How come your prophet was under black magic then? Look, for Allah to send Malaika, right? From for Allah to send Malaika as as a Nabi, as a messenger to the to the face of this earth right this is not the question this is not the question you mentioned to me you mentioned to me a verse you mentioned to me a verse against the black magic why your prophet himself did not protect his ass from the black magic your prophet even he imagined himself having sex but in fact he did not huh? oh people listen i'm sending you messengers within you within you i'll send in messengers this is not the question why your prophet was under black magic why you aren't answering they'll bleed they'll sleep they will eat, but their whole their hearts will never sleep. Even you, you look, you look at your belief first. You're a Christian, right? Why are you saying, sir? Why you're Jesus a prophet, not a protected by Allah? What's wrong with you? Listen, listen, listen. What's wrong with you? What, 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 what why you are terrified to answer? <laughs> was never killed Jesus, peace, of, peace be upon him was never killed no one ever killed him allah took him straight to the heaven your belief is wrong you first you should you should fix your beliefs okay are you your done are you done allah, are you done in, in jesus is is, is a lie. okay okay are you done are, are you done abdul uh, uh, I'm, okay I'm talk. Keep talking, okay man. i can't let me talk you are keep talking i can't talk i mean what's the point of this you want to talk to yourself no okay let me talk and answer listen. you can I please? Can I please? Can I please answer you? Can I please answer you? Can I please answer you? You said my God did not was not killed. Hadith and the sayings of Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam to the people. First, you gotta believe in it. If you don't believe in that, you should never explain anything to people. If you don't believe in anything, anywhere in the world, till now a day, you know, till now a day, till hmm. this time, never a priest, never got up the road. Quran is wrong. Quran is fake. The Muhammad Sallallahu is fake. Even the Jews, the Christians, if you ask ask them, they know who Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is. Can I they answer? Who Muhammad is. You can, know this, right? Can I answer? Yeah, answer. Okay. Please. Isn't it your prophet who said, you are accusing your prophet to be a liar. Isn't it your prophet who said, if 10 Jews only believe in me, the whole Jews will believe? So why are you lying? Number two, 
you said that Jesus he was not killed that's mean Jesus is God and you're a prophet he was killed by poison let me show you the hadith you're a prophet he said that I I, I died by this by don't talk hold on hold on let me talk and answer you here we go he go crazy he go crazy you're a prophet he died like a rat by poison so how come Allah protected Jesus but he cannot protect Muhammad explain to us the, the hadith in the front of you the, the hadith in the front of you and you are the one who said Jesus never been killed, but Muhammad was killed like a rat by poison. So how come Allah protect Jesus, but you don't protect Muhammad? He died his own death, and Jesus peace be upon him. He is in the heavens. You you guys believe that Jesus? Okay, so are you saying that? Are you saying that your Muhammad is lying? Are are you accusing your prophet to be a liar? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You said Muhammad did not that was not killed. So Muhammad did lie. Here we go. Hate in front of you. It's in the screen. Read it. What is it? The hadith in the front of you on the screen it says Muhammad saying I am dying by the poison I ate at Khaybar Muhammad he said listen Muhammad he said I died by the poison I ate in Khaybar are you accusing Muhammad to be a liar I'm not accusing so so why you are lying why you are saying that Muhammad died normally why you listen, if you know the science of hadith Hadith could be sometimes it could be a zaif, it could be a sahih. Okay, is this hadith a sahih or or or, or not? Is is this okay? This is hadith. It could be, you know, if this hadith, if it is, if 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 this hadith has a net. Uh, okay, this is this is a hadith. This is hadith from you. Okay, this is a this is a hadith from a. Okay. is not going back to Aisha Ratrano. I will not never take anything from you. And first of all, I'll never take anything from you because you are kafir. First, you don't believe in anything. You you have to first believe in. Okay, so now so now this hadith is daif. From when I should give you the hadith? Should I look for it? And are you saying to me you believe only Al Bukhari? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, crazy boy. Hold on. Hey, 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 hey. The devil, the devil inside you cannot stop talking. He's horrified. Abdul, don't stop, 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 you donkey. Stop, stop. You know, he's afraid if I talk, it's going to be horrible. You confess will die from only from his breath. <laughs> Think about this. Are you done? Such, are, are you done? Such, did you finish your fault? Against more about did, did you finish? Did you Muhammad finish your gas? Did you finish your gas? I believe much stronger. Did you finish your gas? More Kamil. Did you finish your gas? Stronger mu'min, more more summon believer in Allah <laughs> and in Messenger of Allah. So you have to believe that whatever you're saying. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense to anyone. Okay, brother, brother, I I decide to take shahada. I want to get the vagina. I want to, uh, brother, brother, I decide to get seventy to vagina. I believe you now. Allah is the only true God because He is the only God can provide endless penises and vagina. Now answer the question. The hadith in front of me is it weak that Muhammad he died by poison? You spoke for fifteen minutes to avoid what you said. You said Jesus was saved. He was not killed. You got you got to first come with come up with this. That whatever you are saying first, you have to believe in it. So you believe in Bible, you believe in Christianity, right? That's your belief. So for, first, what you gotta do is you gotta bring your Bible first to the people to say to the people, "Oh, people, this is Bible, and I believe in Jesus. And Jesus is God." So you have to first prove to people that Jesus is God. Uh, no you problem, know? no problem, my friend. Don't worry about proving to people. The, 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 the one is listening to me already believe in that, so I do not need to do that. Now I'm asking you. Why you are avoiding speaking about your prophet dying like a rat? What's what's the problem? What's the pro what's the problem? Why you are afraid? Why you don't worry the hadith in the front of you? Why are you say keep saying that I'm afraid? I'm so read afraid. it then. Then read it. Read it. Go ahead. Read it. It's in front of you. Okay. The Prophet Sallallahu uh, in his in his lifetime in which he died, he used to say, Oh Aisha, <laughs> I feel the pain caused by my food I ate at Khaybar. At the time, at this time, I feel that if my aorta is being cut off from that poison, mm. he said that I feel. He didn't say that I'm. He said what? I feel as if I, my aorta is being cut from that poison. Mm. He said what? I feel. Mm. He doesn't say that I died from that. Mm. But by this by is when he died. He's what he was saying that, but he was dying. As you see, he was dying. He dying by the poison. So what? What? What it's mean to say? I feel he, he, he okay 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 let us let us let us reason together you, you are a smart boy you are the smartest between all your 20 brothers 
if a person he is dying and he says that the poison I ate at Khaybar is cutting my order and then he die Is that mean he died from the poison or he don't from the, die from the cheese? He prayed, he prayed for his ummah. <laughs> he said he said they keep pray salah pray salah pray salah pray to Allah pray to Allah pray to Allah and keep under your right hand keep you know keep keep everything under your right bring that hadith on show 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 the, show what this show have to do the, with my question the people, like, what, what, what he died what, what, what when, when he died we you know what when, when muhammad he died he died he what what is the last thing muhammad he did when he died can you tell me you you are saying yesterday i'm asking you what muhammad what is the last thing what is the last thing muhammad he did what the last thing muhammad he did before he died the last thing he he, he did was he said I want to go back to Allah. I want to go back to my Lord. Are you sure? Lord. Are that you was, sure? That's what, that's what he said. Okay. That's what what, what if I show you that the last thing he did, it was he piss. Okay. First, bring bring, bring the hadith where he said they keep, keep, um, <coughs> praise Allah, praise Allah, praise Allah. And then bring that hadith. You know, we'll, we'll see whatever, whatever you're saying. Is it, is it true or is it lie? Did your you prophet, uh, Abdul, Abdul, give, give me the hadith you show, you, 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 you are talking about show. Give it, give it to me in text. Give it to me in the, as a link. I will open it. Go ahead. Okay, so I will send you a link. Just All right. Because <laughs> the thing is, most of the time, try, try to open the truth. Don't just say things out of, out, out of no reason. You have, if you, to you, to have, to prove that Quran and hadith is, you know, it's a lie and Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is a lie. You know, you gotta prove it. It's not just you know picking an, a verse over here and verse there and try to say to people it's a lie. No, you gotta first go because from the time fourteen hundred years, no one ever got up like this. Like you know the way you did. You're saying Quran is wrong. You're saying Muhammad is fake. Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. You know. No, no one. Ever got so the like so are you saying the Quran is a lie because the Quran saying the Arab they said to him you're a liar. That, that's what I'm saying. It, you know, it's it's so ir ironic that till nowadays that you know you're it's making my belief more strong in Islam. You know, what, but what but what, what why you are lying? Why you are lying? Why you are saying the Christians and the Jews and everybody? Nobody said to him you are a liar. When when the Quran all of it full of verses saying that the Christians and the Jews and non non believers they say to him you are a liar. Why you are saying that? Uh, sorry, I said, I'm looking for something. Just wait a minute, okay? Mm. Just wait. <laughs> So it's in Al Bukhari, hmm. uh, four four <coughs> six three. Give me the link. Give me the link. Give, give me the link. Give me the link. Oh, just wait a minute.
What happened? Just wait a minute. I have two phones. Just wait a minute. I have two phones. I'm sending it to the phone. Just wait a minute. Hmm. <clears throat> and what this hadith is saying tell us it's okay I believe you what what this hadith is saying repeat for us Just wait a minute. I'll call you back in a minute. Okay. Just okay. All right. No problem. <clears throat> you need to find it. You need to find it. <laughs> Do you notice how they get scared and terrified? And he wanna talk and talk and talk because he's afraid what I'm going to say. He, I have to, I, I have to keep talking. Otherwise, people will notice that I am a person who know nothing. Otherwise, he will say something I cannot answer. So we showed him that he's a prophet. He died by poison. He says, where he said I died by poison? It's in the front of you. <clears throat> what do you want more than this? It is literally in the front of you. Let us see if he will call back. And supposedly the, the hadith he will quote for us is going to save Islam now. <clears throat> Do you think he will call back? <clears throat> anyway all right we are waiting for you my friend but please next to uh, next uh, next time you you call try to take a break when you talk <laughs> you made everybody everybody laugh you are terrified my friend you are terrified Literally terrified. I don't know even why why he needed that hadith. I mean, this what hadith would do. <laughs> Muhammad, he said to pray and pray and pray. <laughs> Muhammad, he said, pray for me. And call me, call me. Don't worry, it's okay. It's okay. We are not going to spend the whole day waiting for you to find the hadith. Can't you call? What are we going to spend the whole day, the next year waiting for the hadith? And by the way, you notice that. Maybe some of you do not believe in the devil. 
But did you notice how he's he's going crazy talking so fast? That is the devil inside this person. He is terrified. He is going crazy. He do not know what to say. Muhammad he said, when you say the Allahu Akbar or the, the, the prayer, Shaitan he start farting. The fact it is his followers who go crazy and they start farting, but from their mouth. They don't want you to talk. They don't want even to let you anyone hear you. He, he, he think by speaking over me, that's it. He is going to mute me and that's it. He is going to, to stop Christian press. That is the devil, my friend. And as you see, people are leaving Islam left and right. Now, why this hadith he is looking for is so important. What this hadith will do is going to fix that Muhammad, he said your penis will be endless. Is that will fix that Muhammad, he died by poison? And you said that Jesus, he did not die and Allah, he saved him? <laughs> you know, the funny, he said, the prophet did not say he died by poison. Where he says that? It says that in the front of you. Muhammad, he said, he used to say, used to say, that's mean he is suffering from long, long time. And he himself, he knew, unless you are saying your prophet is not a prophet of God, and now he is getting wrong news. When a man, he came to Muhammad, and Muhammad says to him, drink honey. And the guy came back, and he said to him, my brother, he drank honey, but now he is getting more sick. Muhammad, he said to him, I told you, drink honey. All right. <clears throat> Guys, look at this. Look at this. This guy, he spent all this time to find me this. If I show you, will show you, you will die laughing. The last words which the Messenger of Allah says, uh, spoke where? Prayer, 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 fear Allah. Call me back, call me back so we can love. Call me back. Call me back. <coughs> okay, let me ask you. Yes, uh, Mr. When, when Muhammad, when Muhammad he died, when Muhammad he died, who was with him in the room? Aisha Aisha. So Ali Ali, Ali, Ali was, was there or Aisha? How Ali he got the news? They came later on when they when they heard that Rasulullah has been he's passing away from this world. Okay. So how he heard this? How he heard this? Hmm. I was not there. Where where right. I'm I'm telling you from Okay, what if I show you what if I show you that his wife she said that the last thing he said it was he want to piss you, you Which, you're, listen first you, you gotta quote everything in a way okay here we go the, i caught everything in a way the one who caught that is aisha the hadith in the front of you the hadith the hadith in the front of you hold on ali cannot be with muhammad in his room the last one who was with him in the room and all muslims agree it was aisha and he died in her chest not her chest, her lap. And it doesn't matter. She is his wife. Anyway, nothing wrong with that. So okay. the last thing that he also did was he used Ms. Siwak. Ms. Siwak. Okay, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. Read, read with me. Read with me. This is Aisha. Are you accusing Aisha to be a liar? Are you accusing Aisha to be a liar? Read. The death of Rasulullah She gave him support with her chest, or she said with her lap. He asked for a container to urinate in. He re urinated there and thereafter he passed away mm. so that that hadith i will not take it as a sahih hadith mm. yeah. why because in the, in the in the chain of narration first you have to prove where where does this narration go first from aisha the, from aisha <laughs> aisha you look at it it's it's not, not even spelled right okay by who is that who is that this is translation abdu what's wrong with you <laughs> The Arabic. Look at the, the, look at the name of Aisha first. My friend, who cares? This is a translation. Here we go. This is the name of Aisha in Arabic. Do you have a problem with English? This translation. Who cares? This is the original in front of you. <laughs> oh my God. 
first you told told people what that uh, we we are scared from you. We're, listen, we read that you're 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 you being funny. You are saying to me, look how Aisha is spelled. Listen. Are you telling me now that because the English translator he did not spell the name Aisha wrong, wrong he spelled it wrong? And by the way, this is not Aisha. You are the one who do not know. You are the one who do not know how to read. First, you are telling people that we are we Muslims are afraid of you, right? Yes, you are afraid. Here we go. The hate in the front of you in Arabic. You speak Arabic. Read it. Here we go. Correct. Listen. Correct. Okay, you are saying to me. You are saying to me that your Muslim brother is a donkey. You are making. You are making. You are making fun. You are making fun of a Muslim website of their translation that they did not spell the name of Aisha correctly. What does this have to do with the hadith? What does this have to do with the hadith? The hadith in the front of you. The hadith in the front of you. Like Habib like is like your prophet. Listen, listen, Abdul. Listen, let me tell you something. Let me say something. Each time you insult me, honest to God, I will I will spit at your prophet. Respect yourself. Each time you insult me, I will insult your prophet back. So learn how to behave. You are bringing insult to your prophet. Behave, you donkey. I'm warning you. If you don't want your if you don't want your prophet to be insulted, don't insult me. I'm warning you. Now let us insulting you. Listen, you, you are the one called me Habith. You, the second time you call me Habith, I will say Muhammad is a liar, filthy, don't care, pimp. I warn you, don't say that again. Okay, listen to me first. Now, okay, is the hate in the front of you is correct? Yes or no? Can you read in Arabic? You want to start or no? You want to first say whatever I want to say or no? So, so as you see, the hate is correct. Okay, secondly, okay. secondly, Muslim, the, the hadith you, you gave me, the Muslims are afraid of you, right? For sure, you are afraid of me. Uh, let me ask you. Let me ask you. Okay, let me ask you. Do, do you accept Sunan Ibn Dawood? The hadith you gave me is from Sunan Ibn Dawood. Do you do you believe in Sunan Ibn Dawood? Yes, I do. Okay. So if I show you something from Sunan Ibn Dawood, you will not regret? No, I will never regret anything. Really? Hmm. What about the hadith I show you that your prophet he was drinking poison and he died from poison? You regret it or you accept it? Listen, the hadith that you showed me is said I feel like you know what feel means. So his his feeling he was wrong. You mean you mean he was wrong? I'm not saying he was wrong. So his feeling is right or no? Either you say his feeling was right or you you say his feeling is wrong. He said he said I felt like, but he didn't say I. My friend, I, this is another question. Do he feel right? Is his do he feel right or he feel wrong? Please be be specific and give us the answer. Either you say I agree with him. He was dying because of poison, or he was feeling wrong. I didn't, you, you cannot say it like this. You gotta. No, you, you have gotta, to say it. You are a hypocrite now. You are a hypocrite. You have to say because if your prophet did not die by poison, that's been why. Why he is saying I feel the pain caused. I. It says he used, used to say, used not only once, not second time, not third time. He used and and then and then he died. He died. The last thing he said, I use, and then he says at this moment now, I feel as if my order is being cut. Off. Okay. He didn't say that. I was killed. Mm. Abdul, he was poisoned. Obviously, he was killed. He, he, he said, "I feel my as my orta so, is being show cut me off." Where he said, "Show me a hadith <coughs> where he said I was killed by the poison." Abdul, when he say, "I feel my po the poison is cutting my orta," what is cutting his orta? Feel. What is cutting? What 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 is cutting his orta? What is cutting the artery of Muhammad? Explain to me. The hate in front of you. Be honest. Yeah, what he, so he said, <coughs> "I feel." My friend, I don't care. Are you? Uh, I just want to ask you. Do you agree? Do you agree? Okay. He said, "I feel." Is his feeling a lie or his feeling truth? This guy, you, you gotta first understand. He's. I understand. Give me the answer, my friend. Either you agree with him. Either you agree with him. Either you agree. Okay. So you are saying I don't agree. I don't agree with Muhammad. He did not buy poison. He, my, my prophet was a liar. I'm telling you that. Show me a had so show the show the people who are watching you right now, show them a hadith, a saying of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, where he said that the poison killed me. He died right away. He said that he will say that before. Are you are you crazy? You want him to say that after he die? <laughs> because to say the poison killed me, he have to say that after he die. Now you're now you're in order in order to say the poison killed me he have to say that after he died you, you, are you crazy or what how he will say that after he died the poison killed me it's mean he, he is going to say that after he died so no way he will say killed me he have to say it before he died at the moment he won he said it he was not dead yet so how am I going to say the poison killed me you, you are such a hypocrite bro you, you gotta be you gotta be careful whatever you say <laughs>
<laughs> you are the one who said that. You said, show me what the prophet said. Uh, uh, the poison killed me. Everybody, everybody heard you saying. Everybody heard you saying, show me what the prophet said. The poison killed me. In order to say that, he have to say it after he died. What's wrong with you? Have you ever heard so? Have you ever heard of somebody saying after he died, the poison killed me? What is so, it? so now we have to ask you some questions, right? No, so no, no, you did not answer yet. You did not answer. The question is why why Muhammad died poison? Why Muhammad by your deceptions? Why Muhammad died by poison? And you said to me Jesus was not killed. Why Jesus is not killed, but Muhammad died by poison? So okay, let, let me explain it to you. Mm. So Jesus, as you believe that he was killed, right? Mm. That's what your belief is. Mm. Isn't that isn't that your belief? The Quran confirmed that too. No, isn't that your belief that Jesus was killed? Yeah, I believe. Yeah. Okay, so we don't believe that Jesus was killed. Mm. Get it? Did the Jews kill the prophets? What? Did the Jews kill the prophets? Which prophets? I'm asking you. Did the Jews kill any prophet? Of course, Jews that used to kill in one in once once in one at in one at a it, there was one time where they killed 200 prophets. Okay, can you, can you name one for can you name for one for me? Can, can I name one for yes for you? Okay, mm. so is it is, is it so now what are you trying to say? Is it worth it to to say the names of all those prophets from all the way from no Adam, name one? I said name uh, no 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 I did not say name all no no I did not say name all I said name one. No, I'm just asking you first. I am asking you, my friend. Can you name one? It's funny that your God have time to tell us about Suleiman speaking to the ant or hearing the ant. Suleiman is speaking to the bird, flying carpet, the ring of Suleiman, all fourteen story. But he don't have time to tell us about a name for me, name for me. One prophet was killed by the Jews. Can you please? So Jews Yahya what, where, where we can find in the Quran that Yahya was killed by the Jews? Zakaria, it was a son of Zakaria Yahya. Abdul, look, Abdul, are you listening? Where we can find in the Quran? Don't tell me in the Quran. Your God forgot to mention that Yahya was killed. The Quran tells you that that Allah sent messengers to all the hmm. all, all, all the you know all the Aquams, you know all the Aquams. This is not the question. This is not the question. But, 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 but I'm asking you. Can you find me the verse in the Quran that says that Yahya was killed or John the Baptist? Can you find me that? John the Baptist. Mm. Can you find me that verse where it says that he was killed? So, um, listen, first, um, uh, you, you, uh, 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 where we can find the story? What, 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 wait, 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 what, 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 where we can find, hold on, what, 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 where we can find the story of John the Baptist was being killed? You are the one who mentioned his name. You got yourself busted. I want to see it. Let's come back to Jesus. No, 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 we will not come back to Jesus. No, you get yourself busted. No, you see, you see our change. Hold on, hold on. The Quran says, the Quran says that the Jews, they killed the prophet. The Jews, they killed the prophet. I said to you, name one for me. Shut up. Let me talk. Name one, name one prophet for me. You name for me, John the Baptist. How come your God, Allah, forget to name that he was killed? What kind of God he is? How, 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 how stupid it is to have a book. He forgot to mention one like John the Baptist that he was not killed. Why he forget about him? Explain to us where we can find the story of John the Baptist. And how, how you said that Jesus is God? How your Jesus God? Don't change the topic. Why Allah? He did not. He never mentioned. Why your prophet never mentioned? Why you Muslim never mentioned? Why you forgot about John the Baptist that he was killed? I ask you, who is the prophet was killed by the Jews? You said John the Baptist. Can you show me the story? What's your real name, though? You're, you're an Arab Christian prince. I know that for, for sure. Uh, Muhammad Rasulullah, my real name. Is that a problem with you? <laughs> <laughs> you see, he changed the. You see, you see how they do poo poo. You see how he changed the topic. He's afraid. He's doing poo poo. He is doing poo poo. By the way, what's your name? By the way, suddenly we are talking about John the Baptist. We are talking about John the Baptist. Suddenly he said, "What's your name?" By the way, what's your name? You're by the way. By the way, what's your name? I nice to meet you, brother. This is not don't change the topic, but don't be in a don't be a coward. Where we can find the story of John the Baptist in all Islamic religion? No, do you know uh, Abdullah bin Ubay? I do not know Abdullah. Do you know him? Abdullah bin Ubay, okay. He was a hypocrite like you. No problem. Uh, why he was a hypocrite? Because he did not go and attack the Roman to get the blondie like your prophet. He said to them, attack the Roman and get the blondie girls. Now don't change the topic. Where we can find where we can find the story of John the Baptist was killed. 
otherwise you are admitting that your prophet and your God is a is, a, is an idiot you, you you say in the Quran that the, the Jews they slew prophet but you cannot first, name one for me to go, go to those topics first you got to fix your beliefs your belief is what don't worry about that my belief don't worry about my belief don't worry no no you know I, I I like your belief don't worry about my belief now you see how can I speak to them in a way that just get lost potato You are just a kid. I am Allah. Allah cannot have a son because you don't have a girlfriend, and I don't have a girlfriend. I don't have a son. Both of us, we are Allah. Tomorrow, Allah, we can play cards. The Jews, these two prophets. Okay, name one for me. If Jesus was not killed, who is the prophet they killed, and why Jesus only was saved? If they slew, if they slew one thousand, how many? How many? How many prophets he said? Two hundred thousand prophets. One one deal. They, they slow one two hundred thousand profit <laughs> why the prophet were they were eggs and a chicken was giving eggs two hundred thousand profit the the, the the Jews they slew them <laughs> what a comedy oh boy <laughs> Name for me one prophet was killed by the Jews, John the Baptist. But this is a story in the Bible, not in the Quran. Are you saying to me that your book, your Quran, is a, is a, is a false book? Where we can find in the Quran the story of John the Baptist being killed? It's not there. Okay, can you show it to me in the hadith? Can you show it to me? You have nothing, stupid religion. They think by speaking fast, saying nothing, they can convince us they have a truth. The fact is the opposite. You are like a like like a drum, big from outside, empty from inside. That is Islam. All what we need is just a needle, and the drum is gone. Islam is nothing but a balloon full of gas and bad gas, not even good gas. The second we ask a simple question, gas come out. How, Je how Jesus is God explained? That's very easy to explain, my friend. Jesus right now, according to your cult, is in heaven. He is the only one in heaven. From heaven to heaven, he go back. Human being, from dust to dust. Very simple. <laughs> Human being, from dust to dust. Jesus, from heaven to heaven. And now as we speak, even in your Islamic cult, in the yellow pages of the Quran, according to you Muslims, he is in heaven. Muhammad in the grave. The cockroaches just attacked last week. Oh, sorry, the cockroaches attacked Mecca. Did not uh, did not go to Medina yet. They are in their way. How in the world do I need to prove that Jesus is God? If you believe you that He is in heaven, if you believe that He is going to be coming down as a judge, absolute judge, hakaman muqsitan, how He can be? Absolute judge, unless he is God. To be Muqsit, Muqsit is one of the names of Allah in Islam. Muhammad is not Muqsit. Musa is not Muqsit. Abraham not Muqsit. Only Jesus. And he is Hakam and Muqsit. Judge and just. And the only way for you to be judge and just in the same time if you don't have the nature of a human being, you have the nature of God, because a human being cannot be perfect in judgment. Is that correct, guys? According to the Islamic cult, even Jesus is the one who will come and will destroy the devil. And even the devil, when he sees Jesus, he will melt like salt. Imagine, he will melt like salt in water. Why? Who is just Jesus? 
who can melt the, the devil like salt why the devil did not melt when he see Muhammad we prove it from your books in your books the Messiah is the Word of God and he is the Spirit of God not a spirit from God in your book Jesus is holy chapter 19 verse 19 Let's see what he's saying. When he come, he will kill. When God will come, my friend, he will say to his angels, bring them in front of me. All those hypocrites, liars, donkeys, filthy, bring them. And he will judge you. Yes, he, he will. He, you know, why not? God, he give life, he take life. Isn't it God who did the flood of Noah? What? What the flood of Noah so simply means God killed. What the name of the devil? Harith, the name of your prophet. Let me show you one of the lies Muhammad he came with. According, according to Muhammad, Eve cannot have babies. Each time she try or to, to she get the breath net she lose her baby and then the devil he came to her and he said to her let me try to find the hadith he said to her if you want your son to live call him the slave of shaitan abdul harith you believe it this is a story Muhammad you mentioned <laughs> which mean all of you are the children's of Abdul Harith the slave of shaitan here we go do you see it the Prophet of Allah said, when Hawa become a Britnet, Iblis come to her. Iblis, the first shaitan, the biggest shaitan, the, the king of Satan's, came to her and her children would not live after birth. So he said, name him Abdul Harith. So she named him Abdul Harith and he lived. What the heck? What a stupid prophet. So Allah cannot protect Eve children from Shaitan if she name him anything except the name of Shaitan, the slave of Shaitan. He will not live. You believe it? This is a prophet who promote that he is a believer in one God, saying to us that Eve, she is the first woman she called her son the slave of Shaitan. Abd in Arabic means slave or, or, or a slave, yeah. Usually it's a black slave. Al Harith is one of the names of Shaitan. This is what happened when you have garbage teacher. Look what happened when Shaitan he made Jesus. Let me show you the reference so the Muslim will not say I'm making things up. Here you will see Muhammad, he was speaking about the Shaitan. <clears throat> You see the Muslims in the translation, actually. Look. وَإِذَا صَاحَ فِيهُمُ الشَّيْطَانُ وَإِنَّ الْمَسِيحَ قَدْ خَلَفَكُمْ فِي أَهْلِيكُمْ And when the Shaitan, the Satan, he scream, says he that the Messiah, he is the inheritance of you. And they are going to come and they will say, this is, this is not true, we will not believe. And then when Shaitan he see the Messiah, he will dissolve, he dissolve like salt. When the enemy of Allah, the Shaitan, he see Jesus, he will dissolve like salt, as salt dissolve in water. Do you see it? That is Jesus, my friend, in your cult. And you don't want me to worship him in your cult the shaitan when he see jesus he dissolve like salt
Who wanna follow Muhammad? According to Muhammad, Shaitan was coming to him and during his prayer was jumping over his, his shoulders. Even Shaitan, he command him to do good. My Jesus, when Shaitan, he see him, he dissolve like salt. <laughs> that is my Jesus. Who is your prophet, the child molester? Hmm? Who is your who is your prophet? That doesn't mean he is God. Well, you tell me what does that mean? Why Allah cannot destroy the shaitan? Why Jesus will destroy him? Why Allah cannot do what Allah, what Jesus can do? Jesus, he made the blind see. Jesus, he is repeat from them death. He just he's, he he can make things nobody can do. Allah can do nothing. Allah is just a name. Muhammad, he never spoke to him. He never saw him. He never hit. He never heard his voice. Allah is a fiction God. Does not exist. It is the moon God who has exist before the Arab exist. This is why the, none of the Muslims knows what the word Allah means. It's a foreign word coming from the Aramaic language. Do we have any Muslim want to say something? <clears throat> that does not mean he's God. Well, Jesus is the creator. That, that doesn't mean God the creator. Guys, Jesus is the creator. Jesus is alive for thousands of years. Jesus, uh, he can heal. He can forgive sin. You know, he forgives sin. The Jews, they said to him, well, which authority you have to forgive sin? What this guy is talking about? <coughs> yes, Abdul. Go ahead, Abdul. What do you want to say? So you you are trying to say that uh, that you want to speak to Zakir Naik, uh, Muhammad Hijab, and all them, right? Who are they? Those names? They don't even know how. To, uh, your as the example, Mimi Hijab. He said, Allah, he pray for. He don't pray to. Do you agree with him? Listen to me. Mm -hmm. You listen. I'm listening. First, it's, well, you are mentioning okay. his name. So you, you, he you said, he said, he no said, God. he said, Allah pray for not to. Do you agree with him? What are you saying? Mimi Hijab, he said, Allah, he pray for not to. Do you agree with him? I don't know. Uh, be, to be honest, I don't know what, he, what are you saying right You now? have a debate. What do you mean? You are the one who's talking to me. You said, Muhammad, uh, Mimi Hijab. You are the one who's saying, Zakir Naik. Zakir so Naik. Zakir no, Naik. Hold on. Zakir Naik. Zakir Naik. He said, Zakir Naik. He said, that the word hur is not for women it is all word mean version for men and women do you agree with that is it word hur in heaven or oh allah is it a word mean male and female hur, yes it, it means that male and female yep uh are you sure yes i'm sure 100%. okay if i show you that you both of you you do not know what islam is about and you are a false muslim what you would do okay no listen to me first you're not a muslim right doesn't matter, so my friend. I, I am your master, my friend. Here we go. The Quran in front you're of me. Not my master. You're just a Habib, okay, okay, okay. Here you're we go. You, did you say Habith? Your prophet is a scumbag. He is a filthy. He's a child molester. He's a donkey. He's a poo poo. I told you, don't yeah. say that word again. You listen first. Cause the thing is, you're cursing my prophet live on to the people. Okay. No problem. Here we go. Let me show okay. you that you are. Let me show you that you are a donkey. In chapter fifty-five, verse number fifty-six, it says yet Muthahun. How those are male, but they are going to be having sex and they will lose virginity and bleed. Okay. Do male have thumbs? Mute, mute YouTube, mute YouTube. Listen to me only from Skype. So who is the donkey here? You and your Zachary Naik, both of you are donkey. It when says you are okay. You really, so you really how you how you say Naik. how you say so that you, how you agree you how you agree you donkey how you agree how you agree donkey how you agree how you agree that that the word whore male and me female answer answer I got you I just got you busted in two seconds how you say that the word whore male male and then answer answer I want an answer I want an answer. Then you okay, you can bust me, but you cannot bust because you're you're a cop, you're a cop, you're a liar, you're a hypocrite. <laughs> so you have no answer now, right? So you have no answer. 
So now you stumble. There's no answer. How Allah He says <laughs> that they they will lose the virginity of their vagina, your donkey, and you say that they are male and female. Answer, answer, answer. <laughs> Child molester, prophet. Child molester, prophet. I know what Khabith. Khabith is Allah. The one who deceive you, he said, I am Allah. He said, I am the best of the deceivers. Did Allah say, I am the best of the deceiver? Shut up, donkey, donkey coward. You see, you call me, you could not maintain yourself for two seconds. I, you mentioned to me, Zakir Naik. I said, Zakir Naik, he says, the whore is male and female. You said, I agree with him. The second I show you the verse of the Quran, you start changing topic, calling me names. How in the world he says, Yatmuthahunna, and they are male and female, you donkey. Male have vagina. The word thumbs is when a woman she lose the skin inside her vagina, as simple as that. This is what he meant. Those women they don't have period. This is heaven. In heaven, there's no period. Stupid donkey, you and Zakir Naik. You don't you cannot even Zakir Naik. If I take him in two five minutes, I, I'm going to make him shish kebab. I'm going to make him dust. The same when Jesus he's he make the shaitan you know dissolve like salt by the power of my lord. And this is what I do with you. Now, if you have an answer, call me your donkey. You said you agree that this is male and female. If you want to call to call me names, no problem. Stupid donkeys. Mimi Hijab, he says, Allah, he pray for, not to. And now we have Allah, he pray to Allah. This is Hijab. Mimi Hijab, he said, the 4,000 years. For 4,000 years, the Jewish instructed to worship God alone. Not a single Jew. 4,000 years. And then we find in the Quran, the Quran saying that the Jews, they worship a person. His name is Uzair as the son of Allah. So for 4,000 years, they did not. Yes, Abdul. Worship, not a single Jew. Mute, mute YouTube. Mute YouTube. YouTube. You're, you're such a dog, man. You're just... Okay, did you say to me, dog? Is it is it is it the last Muhammad is Kilab? Last name of Muhammad. <laughs> what is it? Um, I'm asking you. Be, be honest. Is the is the last name of Muhammad? Is the last name of Muhammad? Muhammad ibn Kilab. Yes or no? You're a dog, man. Why you are calling me dog? If your last name, your prophet last name is dog, and he married from Zainab bin Tujah, Zainab the daughter of the donkey. Yes or no? You're a bastard. You know? Do you know that you're a bastard? The bastard is you're your prophet. He your was born. Sex. You're a prophet. You're a prophet. Your prophet was born. Shut up, donkey. You are calling just to call names. Your prophet was born four years after his father. So he is a bastard guaranteed. And I can show you the reference. There is no way a person he's born four years after his father is not a bastard. Shut up. Son of Muta. I will not be surprised if you yourself, your mother, she did Muta too, you know, in, in the bar and she gave birth to you in the elevator. Call names as much as you wish. You cannot answer me, you cannot refute me. Anything you say to me, I will show you a reference, will destroy you. You say dog, your the prophet last name is dogs. You believe it? You say donkey, you're a prophet. He married from Zainab ibn Tujahsh. Zainab, the daughter of the donkey. You say bastard, your prophet. He was born four years after his father died. What do you want to say? Tell me more. Do you want more? <laughs> 